Hello everyone. Today we will solve case at paper 2023 part paper 1 which was the general paper. The first main was comprehension. So a passage was given based on which few questions were asked. So five questions were asked based on this comprehension about Rabindranath Tagore and English people. So the first question was what according to the author contributed to Indians forming ideas about the foreigners. The correct answer is option B English literature. The second question what was lacking in the educational system of that time according to the author. The correct answer is C diversity. Third question why did indian leaders believe that the english will give freedom to our country the right answer is option b they provided shelter to many political leaders from around the world fourth question which quality of the english impressed the author the answer is liberal humanism option d fifth question why was the author influenced by the speeches of john bright the correct answer is because his speeches were relevant beyond national boundaries option a the next question from sixth question it is not about comprehension it is from the english and the other knowledge which we have general knowledge since it is a general paper so sixth question match the following do we aristotle g krishnamurthy and plato here a is matched to shared experiences experience is the greatest of human kinds do we Aristotle, ethos, pathos, and logos. J. Krishna Murthy, communication is for learning from each other. Plato is for oral communication is superior to written text. So the correct option is option C. Seventh question: Which of the following statements on effective communication is correct? The correct answer is option number D. Both one and two are correct. That is, communication is exchanging information, and communication is understanding the emotion and intention behind the information. Eighth question: Which type of communication promotes collaborative learning in a classroom? The correct option is option C, group communication. Which one of the following is a reading technique? The correct answer is option A, skimming. Tenth question: Two statements are given. One is assertion, and the other is reason. We have to choose the correct code. So the answer here is option A. Both A and R are correct, and R is the correct explanation of A. Moving ahead to eleventh question, which is based on general maths which of the following figure does not belong in the series the correct option is option number d fourth twelfth question on the total amount received by x 20% was spent on purchase and 5% on the remaining of the remaining on transportation if he is left with rupees 1520 what is the initial amount the correct option is option number b 2000 thirteenth question aman viman and chiman enter into a partnership by investing 36000 44000 28000 aman is a working partner and gets one fourth of the profit and the remaining profit is divided amongst the three in the ratio of their investments what is the profit that chiman gets if aman gets net profit of 5400 here the correct answer will be option number a 2100 moving on to the 14th question two men and three boys can complete a piece of work in 10 days while three men and two boys can complete the same work in 8 days in how many days can two men and one boy complete the same work here the answer is 12.5 days option number c 15th question A hare takes nine leaps in the same time as dog takes four, but the dog take leap is two one by third meter long. While the hare's is only one meter, how many leaps will the dog have to take before catching the hare? If the hare had a head start of sixteen meter, the correct response is option number B, one ninety two. Sixteenth question. In the following question, three statements are given followed by four conclusions. Here we have to decide based on these statements. So all trees are hills. Some animals are hills. All animals are birds. Four conclusions are given. The correct answer is option number C. Only one and four follows. Moving ahead to seventeenth question, the triangle, square, and uh, circle is as shown in the figure. So the question is, which one of the areas represents urban educated who are not hardworking? You can clearly see here it is option number C. Four. Eighteenth question. Answer the following questions on the basis of the given information. Here it could be option uh, D or uh, C. So uh, check once. Nineteenth question. 
what is the value of the given uh, fraction so if you simplify this fraction you will get the answer as option b is 10 behavior is related to impropriety in the same way as word is related to usage option number a moving ahead to 21st question we have to study the table given below and uh, we have to see which is the correct option what would be the yield of the crop in 2015-16 area and cultivation remaining the same option correct answer is option number b 2518 22nd question we have to study the following graph is given where we have to study the graph and answer the question what was the total income of company y in 2008 and 2009 together so the option is uh, correct answer is option number c 85.5 lakh 23rd question a question is followed by information in three statements so we have to study the question along with the information and decide which is the statement which is necessary and sufficient to answer the question so it is about the two digit number the correct response is option number d one and either two or three 24th question a new express train has a capacity of 500 seats of which 10 percent are in executive class and rest are in chair care chair car during the journey the train was booked to 85 percent of its capacity if the executive class was booked to 96 percent of its capacity then how many chair car seats were empty during that journey the correct answer here is option number b 73 25th question is very simple two quantities are given if you simplify column a and column b you will get the correct answer is both the quantities are equal that is you'll get column a and column b as 10 so option number c 26th question, which one of the following organization maintains the database related to allocation of IP address of the internet? So since it is allocation of IP address and internet, the correct answer will be option number C, I can. Moving ahead to the next question, 27th, we have to match the following, where uh, they have given about the internet, intranet, extranet and ethernet. So it is uh, basically option number A. 28th question, in which year was EduSat uh, the first satellite launch? Uh, uh, built exclusively to serve educational sector launch it was in the year 2004 29 question has the following uh, where we have to match the physical virtual hybrid and recorded uh, video so here uh, the correct option is option number d where physical classroom is offline synchronous virtual classroom is online synchronous hybrid classroom is online or offline asynchronous recorded video is online and offline asynchronous 30th question, which is the alternate term referring to website domain name? It is option number A, uniform resource locator. Moving ahead to question number 31. Cartagena protocol on biosafety is a part of which of the following protocols? Since it is on biosafety, it is option number D, convention on biological diversity. Next again, 32 question, assertion and reason is given for uh, from which we have to select the correct code. So the answer is both A and R are correct and R is the correct explanation of A, option number A. 30, moving on to 33rd, methane, a greenhouse gas, it is emitted from which of these? So basically it is emitted from landfills and wetlands, so it is option number C. 34th question mass the following, histosols, antisols, gelisols, eridisols. So the correct option here is option number uh, A. 35th question, which one of the following is not correctly matched? Uh, it is very clear that it is Kolkata, Indian Institute of Foreign Management, option number C. 36th question, which Asian center of learning is often considered as the first university and was located in present day Bihar? So uh, it is basically option number A, Nalanda. What is the primary focus of oriental learning program in India? It is for promoting interdisciplinary studies, option number C. Which among the following cannot be a standalone institutions? It is option number C, nursing schools. A university that shares learning resources with different universities can be described as it is a meta university. Option number C. 40th question NAC NAAC is an accrediting body. Option number B. Moving on to 41st question, we have 10 more remaining. Identify the combination of three main aspects of pupil learning which are important for effective teaching from the following and select the correct code. It is option number B, which is pupil attending to the learning experiences, appropriate learning experiences and pupil receptive to the learning experience 1, 2 and 4. So option number B. Identify the institution which is directly responsible for the professional growth of teachers in India. It is option number B, TLC. 43rd question, which of the following is not a characteristic of Swayam Prabha? So Swayam Prabha, uh, not a characteristic of Swayam Prabha is basically option number D, which is not a platform for MOOC, MOOC. 44th question. Suppose a teacher performs self-assessment where she has to examine the pedagogy, articulate reason and strength for strategies used in the classroom. The method will be basically reflective teaching where she will reflect what she has thought and come up with new strategies. 
फोर्टी फिफ्थ क्वेश्चन वट इज द मेजर पर्पज ऑफ सी बी सी एस चॉइस बेस्ड क्रेडिट सिस्टम इन हायर एजुकेशन सो बेसिकली इट इज टू प्रोवाइड फ्लेक्सिबिलिटी इन को सिलेक्शन एंड क्रेडिट एक्यूमेशन इज ऑप्शन नंबर बी फोर्टी सिक्स क्वेश्चन इट स्टेट्स विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट बेस्ट डिस्क्राइब द पॉजिटिविज्म अप्रोच पॉजिटिविज्म अप्रोच इज बेसिकली क्वालिटेटिव रिसर्च मेथड सो ऑप्शन नंबर सी Forty seventh in a research study investigating the effects of a new drug on BP, which of the following steps involves recruiting participants and collecting relevant information? It is option number A, data analysis. But I have a doubt. It might. It can also be hypothesis testing. So it depends. So forty eight question. Which section of a thesis is typically responsible for explaining the research objectives, methodology, and scope? So uh, the part of the research paper where we can see about the outline, the methodology, and the scope is abstract. option number c what is the main purpose of including references and citations so we have learned citation is very important in order to give credit to the work and ideas of the other researchers to appreciate their work option number b last question how does ict enhance data analysis in research it is basically by providing access to advanced statistical softwares for automated analysis where you can use different statistical softwares i hope you have uh, got all the responses kindly like share subscribe thank you have a nice day all the best